Kia ora, I'm Nathan Twaddle, and over the coming months, thanks to the team at Mighty River Power, I'll be taking you on a journey inside rowing. Our elite teams train ruthlessly to compete at World Championships and World Cup events every year. Finish line just five, four, three, two strokes to the line. I was lucky enough to compete at five World Championships. My best result, a world title in Gifu, Japan, with George Bridgewater in the men's pair in 2005. Between August 30 and September 6, our rowers are up against the best on the planet once again at the 2015 World Rowing Championships in France. To find out a bit more about this event and to understand its significance, I thought it would be good to catch up with Rowing New Zealand's Athlete Development Manager, Judith Hamilton. So Judith, what does it mean for an athlete to make the World Championship team and try and get on the podium? Our athletes train full time here at, at Lake Karapiro and then compete each year at World Cups and World Championships to, to test themselves against the best in the world. As most Kiwis will know, 2016 is set to be a massive year, not just for rowing but for a lot of sports. I understand we've got a pretty big team, how many boats are we trying to qualify? Lofty goals but we're trying to qualify all 14 boats, um, that would be the first time for us and we believe we've got the athletes and coaches that can, can achieve that. So how exciting is the next year going to be in the lead up? If we can achieve what we want to achieve, those 14 boats, the momentum going into next year will just be electric. I hope you enjoyed the first episode of Inside Rowing with Mighty River Power. Make sure you follow our rowers as they take on the world. We'll catch you next time.